At 10 tonight, San Mateo police say the county's new pilot program to pair mental health professionals with police officers on 911 calls is already having an impact. The program launched yesterday in four of the county's largest cities. KTVU's Janet Katsuyama joins us now live from San Mateo after speaking with one team about the first days on the job. Jana. And Julie, this might only be day two, but San Mateo police tell me that already their mental health specialist has been called out into the field multiple times. This week, when San Mateo police get 911 calls, there's a new team member ready to respond. I've sat in dispatch. I've done ride alongs with the officers, so I kind of know what calls they're getting throughout the day. I have a radio on me all the time when I'm on duty, and so I'm hearing all the calls that are coming in. Brianna Fair, a social worker and mental health specialist, joined San Mateo Police this week as a crisis response clinician. I've been to some of the schools. I've been to also some houses and just some businesses. San Mateo County's new program pairs mental health specialists with police in the four largest cities, San Mateo, Daly City, Redwood City, and South San Francisco, to help police better respond to people in mental health crises. I think that it can help the community overall because we don't have police officers doing a million different jobs. Having them take on that role of mental health clinician without years of training um, just seems unfair, really. And San Mateo Police Department spokesperson, Officer Allison Gilmore, says police get calls to respond to mental health crises daily. Our officers are not mental health experts, so it is great to have someone who is specifically trained in mental health and behavioral health to be able to help those individuals who are experiencing a crisis who may not necessarily was comfortable with a police officer. San Mateo County says about 50% of the people booked into their local jails have a mental health condition. Nationwide, according to NAMI, the National Alliance on Mental Illness, about 2 million people with mental illness are booked into jails every year. There are over 300 diagnoses under mental illness. Carol Gosho, who ends up the NAMI San Mateo branch, says people with schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, and severe depression in particular often end up getting arrested instead of getting treated. That's where the difficulty begins, where they may end up with a criminal record, and instead of going to the hospital, they're taken to jail. This pilot project will cost San Mateo County about $1.5 million over two years. Some residents think it's money well spent. I actually do think it could be good use of funds, especially if it helps a lot of people. And having a specialist there could help de-escalate the situation. And this two-year pilot program will be evaluated by a team at Stanford University. If it is deemed successful, then police are hoping that they can get more funding to get more mental health specialists on their team. Reporting live from San Mateo tonight, Jana Katsuyama, KTVU, Fox 2 News.